Hello, I'm Carla Genovese and I'm going to ask a few questions to Callum Wilson here. If you hadn't have become a footballer, what other sport might you have committed to? Um, I probably would have, uh, I like playing cricket, um, so I might have uh, pursued playing cricket, but um, apart from that I probably would just, uh, probably just would have gone for my career. I've got a um, degree in commerce, so I probably would have uh, pursued that. Okay. Yep. Um, do you ever eat junk food? Very rarely. I try I try not to. Maybe after a game sometimes I eat a little bit of junk food. Um, I might get a pizza or eat some, uh, eat some HJs, but uh, apart from that I try not to. It's only a sometimes food for, uh, for most of us boys. What kind of movie do you prefer out of romance, action, horror and drama? I'd probably say drama. Um, I'm not really a big fan of romance movies. Um, I get sucked into them sometimes, but I don't really like watching them. Um, I'm not a, yeah, I don't mind horror, but I think um, drama is probably my favourite, yeah. Okay. What have you always wanted to do that you still haven't done? Probably go to Europe. I haven't been to Europe yet. I'm uh, pretty keen on going there and travelling around and having a good look at Europe, so that's probably uh, the next thing on my agenda when I get half a chance. Uh, what was the hardest thing you ever had to give up for your football? Um, probably... Just uh, sometimes on, on the weekends, I don't have to give up a lot of, uh, sort of time with my friends and that on the weekends, so I can't, you know, go out and do uh, some of the things that they do. But um, you know, that's something that I still can do every now and then. So it's not it's not a massive thing I have to give up. Okay. What is the worst question anyone has ever asked you? Well, um, I've been asked a few bad ones. Um, recently, I got asked by uh, a young kid why the Eagles suck so much. Which was, uh, it was a pretty tough question. So, yeah, it's probably the worst one. Um, what inspired you to start a football career? Um, basically, just when I started playing footy when I was, when I was six years old, I, th I found that I loved playing footy and loved everything that came along with it. So I just felt that um, you know, I had a passion for it and then if I wanted to continue, um, continue with it, then I've, you know, if I gave everything I got, then I'd be able to do it. So. Do you have a part-time job? Uh, no, I don't. I was uh, I was studying, I was studying, doing my degree for the last five years. But um, this year, I'm just doing the doing the Erms program, Eagles Rock My School. And um, apart from that, I've got a little bit of free time, which is which is always good. Okay. If you ever won a million dollars in lotto, what would you do with it? Um, stop question. Um, I'd probably give a give a little, little back back to my parents. They spent a lot of money on me over the years, and I'd probably uh, give them a bit. Um, I'd probably give a little bit to charity, like I'd find an organisation that I that I like, and I give a bit to charity, and then I'd uh, probably keep a little bit to myself to go to go travelling. Good idea. Yeah. What is the best thing that has ever happened to you? Um. Yeah. Uh, I don't know there's a lot of things. Probably a lot of things I should say, but. Um, probably as far as footy goes, obviously getting drafted was a big thing to play for the Eagles. My first game with the Eagles was a pretty big, pretty big moment for me, considering that um, my family and a lot of my friends had, you know, been following me in my footy for a long time. So I guess playing my first game was a big thing, but also um, winning the 2009 Premiership when I played with South Fremantle was probably the other big moment that I've had.